My name is Casey Gehring. I teach fourth grade at Horace Mann Elementary. The school district gave us Surface Books to replace the older computers that were in the classrooms. It helped everyone get logged on, get the OneDrive and the email and everything up and going. And then they've really let you integrate it into your classroom at your own pace and what you're comfortable with. I think the best part about having the Surface in the classroom is just being able to interact with the kids more and be here for them. Good morning, fourth graders. Good morning. It's letting us interact. It's allowing us, you know, another way of looking at what each other's doing, displaying our work. If something is going to be equal, that's a cue that we're doing division. Do is I'll put directions for the kids on the board and then I'll bring the computer to small group and be able to work on something here with them. And then it's saved in the computer. We can see it, refer to it another day on another lesson. In, but the rest of the kids can see their directions and what it is I'm expecting them to do up on the board and it's just in freeze mode. So to kind of put it in a little bit better perspective. On Thursdays for me, I change rooms three times in a row. As I'm transferring rooms, there's another teacher in here. I'm already logged in and everything and I just connect to the projector so I'm ready to go and set up with all of the programs I need open, ready to go uh, within five seconds of walking into the room. How about we go with some Japanese imperialism? There you go. And you're not tethered to the front of the room. For instance, today I was having the kids do annotations on a PowerPoint. They didn't have to come to the room. It cut down on the transition time of calling a kid forward. I simply walked over, handed it to them, and they just did it right there. The best classroom management skill is proximity. And you're not stuck here in the front of the room. And now I can teach in the back of the room and be right by them instead of right by my desk. The Surface Book. I can walk around with an entire computer in my hand with the keyboard or without the keyboard in tablet mode. And it's made doing PowerPoints easier. Uh, I can now annotate on Word documents so that the kids can see it. I can put up my class OneNote, my PowerSchool, anything. It's made everything accessible in my hands. Sunny, can you pick up where Aiden left off? On my end, when I'm not projecting, I can see what I did last class period, make sure that I asked those good leading questions to, to get all the answers that I wanted to, save it for multiple class periods. It's so nice to not have your back to the class being at the board having to write on Active Inspire or PowerPoint or OneNote. It's really nice to be able to walk around the classroom. In elementary, you're moving around and you're going to check with lots of students and it's really nice to be able to take the information with you so you can reference and show them on your tablet something that they need to use for that assignment. I felt like I was always pinned in the front of the room, either under the document camera or right in front of the board, and the kids would sit there and they'd be like, scoot over, I can't see what's behind you. And so I'm not blocking their screen anymore. I like to move a lot when I'm teaching, and especially to help my kids with proximity and helping you know, keep them on task and remind them where we're at. And being able to walk around with the tablet and teach at the same time has really made me have more movement in the classroom and interact with the kids a bit more while I'm giving my lessons. These kids are growing up on technology. Okay, will you highlight to us the parts of the problem? They're really motivated to be the person that gets to use the pen and write on the surface, or to be the person who I'm videotaping while they're giving their answer or take a picture of their work. So it's an engagement tool as well as a learning tool. With the Prime Minister of Japan. It made me put a lot more effort into trying to think of ways to get the students involved so that it's not just such a one-sided teaching. Um, always trying to find ways to get the, the students to interact somehow or to have some kind of active engagement in the learning. So be it from handing the tablet to somebody to annotate something on the screen or coming up with different activities where I can have them going back and forth around the room doing things because again I have the room set up in a way that allows for movement easily because I'm constantly moving throughout the room. One of the applications on the surface, you're allowed to annotate you know, PDFs or anything and then save that document as a new document, which is really helpful because sometimes you don't get documents in editable forms. I feel like everything is just, it's in one place and it's all one click away. At the end of the day, I can take my surface book to meetings or district trainings. If I'm working outside of MAN on a different site, I have all of my files and materials there in the surface book that I need.